I cheated before, right? And the man that I was cheating with, I felt him days later. Even yeah, when I got damn. home. I was a big yeah. bro. No, <laughs> actually, actually, I'm gonna be honest, the man I was cheating on had a way bigger but I still felt him inside of me when I left. I felt I felt his smell. Every everything on me just was him. It took me day. I had to stay away from. It's called Molly. I had to stay. I don't do drugs. I it. had to stay away from my significant other for a few days just to get the stench of him off me. Damn. That 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 man touched her soul. When a man fuck your woman like that, he automatically becomes the. That got away. Even if you don't find out, right? Let's say you don't find out, right? So y'all done got gray, old, and senile together. Y'all got grandkids, great grandkids, great great grandkids. Your woman is gonna tell your great great grandkids the story about the nigga that should have been their great great granddaddy. Y'all think I'm playing, but I'm dead ass, bro. You see how she described that? Nah, son. What's the freakiest thing you've ever done? I'm a porn star, so one time I did anal with this guy, and I got in his shower after, and I shit myself, and I stomped the turd down the drain. Oh! Oh, no! No, she nasty. She nasty. She, na she nasty. She nasty. That's nasty. That's nasty. That's, na that's nasty. She had doo doo on her foot. It, like. Yeah, I got shot when I was 23. I married a young lady that everybody was telling me not to, but I was like, look, y'all don't understand her, our love. So we get to a huge argument one day, and the first time I tried to leave, she ran out the house and, like, hit the windshield with a shovel and, like, shattered the windshield. Ooh, that's pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, that's Not too crazy. long after that, we get into another argument. So I had a pistol on, on, on deck at all times, so she wouldn't grab it. Like, you're not going to leave this time. You're going to listen to me finish this argument. I was holding our son at the time, right? I turned to leave. She shoot me in the forearm the bullet goes through my forearm and goes across his forehead i'm looking at my son his face is bleeding my arms bleeding i set my son down oh, and i look snap got the gun pointed at my head bro and i'm like okay i'm ready to leave all i could do is close my eyes and all i heard was click oh shit so then she's Yo. messing with the gun the only thing i can think of like if i try to run she gonna shoot me in the back so i just ran towards her and just turned into a ufc maniac bro a few months ago i did a podcast talking about how my ex-wife shot me clip of that video went viral here it is now if you know that story you know that i was holding our two-year-old son during an argument my ex-wife pulled a gun on me shot me in the forearm the bullet went through my forearm and grazed his forehead then she pointed the gun at my face and squeezed the trigger and the gun jammed god protected me what you don't the know gun is that i divorced her immediately I got custody of our son, and she did three years in prison. She went on with her life. I went on with mine. That's crazy, Quick bro. update. She just got arrested for murdering her boyfriend. It's all wow. A Georgia woman was arrested years after the body of a man was found in an Alabama shallow grave. Long story short, she found out her boyfriend was cheating, shot him in the head three times while he was asleep. All right, here's the moral of the story. If you find out somebody is cheating on you, just leave. If you're in an abusive situation, just leave. And also... Always stay prayed up. Oh, I'm glad that he made that that good decision for himself and his son, because that could have ended very very bad. Oh, sorry about that. Hey, you're hot. Thanks. Yeah, are you feeling chemistry? You your stuff as? I don't know, but yours hot. No, you have to guess. What are you dressed as? No, you have to guess. Hey, what is, she, what is she dressed up as? Wait, wait, wait. No. Wait, 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 wait. She wants to be here. Yeah! Oh, you guess your number? Yo, tell me what this Damn, that's some hate in that shit. Oh, that's, that's, that's just pure hate, son. Now, that's the situation. She, she, dude. She was feeling my boy. She was feeling him. Mm. Mm. 
ask you one more question? Um, do you guys have applications? I'm sorry? Do you guys have application? Do you have an application? For... Boyfriend application. Oh. I'm sorry? Boyfriend application. Oh. <laughs> Boyfriend application? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Oh, like me? Yeah, yeah. Like, like me? Oh. Yes. Yeah, you're, you're single or? Yeah. We're well, saying numbers. You want to be friends? <laughs> sure. Sure. All right, cool. <laughs> Riz. Okay. I see you, my boy. She said, like, 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 like me? Damn. When the last time somebody tried to holler? You can't just walk past me without talking, now. Oh, I'm sorry. How you doing? I just wanted to know who you was, you feel me? I'm a word. Yeah, I'm working at them. Okay. I'm daddy. I'm in. Gavin, excuse me. Yeah, okay. You real Anybody playing with you? Where well, you finna go to? That's the real I'm question. Go home. Where? Yeah. So you finna go home without putting my number in your phone or something? You got me Nah. Yeah. Oh, who who this girl think I am, man? We can't we can't meet in the middle with your number, bro. Okay, come, on over here. come on now. Put mine in your phone. Okay. You gonna put it to use, right? I am. I'm gonna text you right now. Mm. All right. Eight one six. What's your name? Yeah. Daddy, you know my name. Mm. <laughs> hey, my boy got game. My boy got game. What can I get for you? You bet I taste sweet? Oh, do say neat. Okay. And what's your name? Francisco? That easily has to be one of the best names I've ever heard. And one and two. You so cute. Oh, and this is my song. Shout out my neighbor what I think. Let's turn this party up. You wanna take shots on you? You know me? You know me a shot? Okay. See, that's a man. Buying me a shot, that's what I call a man. You wanna do a body shot? Body shot. Oh, okay, girlfriend. Whoop you woo. <laughs> Yo, I hate bartenders. My fact, hate is a strong word, but I dislike how when you go to a bar, the, the bartenders be trying to like soup you up. You know what I'm saying? Like, all right, you wanna you wanna tip? I feel it, but stop, like, bitch. Don't create no fantasy for me. They make you feel like you going you gonna leave with that pussy by the end of the night. Like that's how them bartenders be getting you. About four Long Island iced teas later, bro, you, you come to your senses. I wasn't even trying to spend that much. Then you got to give her her tip. After that whole transaction is over, she get to treating you like you a stranger. Like, bitch. After all that money I done spent on you, you going to treat me like I'm a stranger? Yeah, I don't like bartenders. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the video for today. Thank you. If you made it to the end, you know what I'm saying? Got the over, that pink overdose last hoodie on. But, um, yeah, man, I appreciate y'all for coming. Make, I appreciate you for joining me and watching these videos. People are crazy. You know, since I've been doing this, these reaction videos, I've seen some of the strangest things that I don't think I should be looking at. I've heard some very crazy things that, um, you know, I don't think my version is we're ready for. Yeah, man. People are crazy. But anyway, if you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Make sure you hit the like. Leave a comment so me and you can conversate. And I'll leave my Instagram up so you can hit me up on Instagram. Squat.